Hi guys, we're going to go over how to connect uh, and test an LED light. Um, it's very easy to do. Uh, you can do it with a regular 9 volt battery. Um, I have to have a 5 volt power supply here, so I'm going to use my power supply. Uh, it's very easy to do. Uh, you just notice there's a positive and negative to the side. Uh, if you look closely on top, you're going to see the it indicator that's up there, the plus and the minus. If you do connect it backwards, uh, it won't damage anything, so it just won't light up. Just make sure the polarities are correct in order for it to light up. As you can see, it lights very bright. Uh, don't look into it directly as it might blind you for temporary, so um, try to use some caution that way. Uh, one other thing, uh, the life expectancy of these LED lights uh, is around 50,000 hours. Uh, when you compare it to the DLP bulb, which is rated anyway from two to 5,000 hours, it's like a tremendous difference. Uh, that should last you a long time. Uh, the trick to these things is to, to keep them cool and they don't know, overheat and burn out uh, prematurely. One thing I want to mention that um, when you do get these in the mail, uh, you'll find that some of them have a heat sink component already in the back of them. Uh, we try to clean them out as best as we can, but sometimes you might get some of that in the back. Now, like I said earlier, the, the trick is to keep these things cool and the way that you could do that is by putting heat sink component in the back of it. Uh, put enough of it so it'll pull the heat away from the, from the LEDs so that they don't end up lasting a lot longer than even 50,000 hours.